Congratulations on the film. Thank you. Uh, it's a story about trauma and friendship. What was it about this story that spoke to you and made you want to take on the role? And also, it's your first film after you've had a, a small break <laughs> from, from filmmaking. Um, I don't think, you know, it was just one of those things where I was reading it and I feel like it's really rare to read something with like a, the melody and the, the kind of slow building rhythm that this movie has. Um, I, I love Marvel movies or superhero movies as much as the next person, but it, there was just something that was so refreshing. I just hadn't seen something like that really since Winter's Bone. Um, so I felt adamant that, you know, I really, really want to make this. I didn't know when because I was still, you know, on my hiatus. Not in quotes, I really was on a hiatus. But um, and then after getting dinner with Lila, I just I just knew that she was she was the person, and, and we were shooting three months later. And it's your first time producing, so Lila's first time directing as well. Yeah. I mean, what was it like? What was the dynamic like? How exciting must that have been? It's oh, first it's time incredible. for everyone. I mean, I I really just only want to produce to be able to work with people who I'm a fan of or who I'm excited by, and to just protect their creative process. So I just felt like the most important job for me as a producer was making sure that Lila had the freedom uh, and felt the support to, to do, to follow her instincts and, and do what she does best. So I just tried to hide quietly in a corner unless somebody called for me. <laughs> but do you want to do more producing though? Absolutely, yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. Hey Jennifer, Scott from Hey You Guys. Hi. Lovely to meet you. Congratulations on the film. Thank you. Um, Lindsay is such a wonderfully kind of complex character. How did she challenge you in ways that maybe you hadn't been challenged before as an actress? Um, I mean, the you know this kind of constant um, feedback from the past that you know originally we thought would be kind of explained in flashbacks, and then it wasn't until we were in the edit that we decided everything would be in the present. So this kind of carrying this invisible injury and um, everything from the past but in, in such a quiet way because Lindsay is you know a quiet kind of withdrawn person um, so I guess probably trying to convey things without saying them would have probably been the I don't know why my hands needed to get into that um, would have been the most difficult part. Uh, I interviewed Brian recently and he's very very funny and I can imagine you two had a lot of fun but was it was it nice to work with him on this relationship and see him bring extra strings to his bow that maybe we hadn't seen before? Yes I mean he is the most talented actor I, I mean there's just so much he's going to do and um, yeah it's a quick bonding experience you know when you're doing kind of therapy while figuring out the dialogue for your characters you get to know people very quickly and um, I love Brian. Fantastic. Wish you all the best. Thanks Thank so much. You. Hello, Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed. Yeah. Nice.